Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Omen. I wanted to bring you another quick tip, and this is for the sentry placement on the raid map. So, I find that in this map for the domination game type mode, there's a real great location that you can actually put the sentry gun to help lock down B. So, you get your sentry gun, you put it right in between the, the little alleyway that overlooks B right before either team is able to take it. And what this allows you to do is to flank them on the left and right side without them uh, being able to attack you because anything coming up that middle is going to be taken care of um, by, by the sentry gun and round you always have the option to uh, control it or not. I find that it's best to just not control it, uh, let it uh, do its own work, and then it frees you up to additionally get some more kills and to help build your streak. So you notice in the bottom right hand corner I'm actually going to put a counter of how many kills this gets. Um, on a usual map, depending on the placement or the location of the sentry gun, you can usually get probably between about 2 and 4 um, kills uh, per gun. and I know there's a video that was put out by Woody's Gamer Tag that actually breaks down on average um, the number of kills you get per score streak. If I remember, I'll put a link to that video in the description. But what this shows is uh, us locking down B because we have the sentry gun behind. And then what I like to do is I like to throw a trophy system down uh, right in front of it. So that stops grenades from killing it, um, it stops concussions and EMPs from getting to it. And then, if you happen to have the Guardian, what you can do is you put the Guardian facing uh, the opposite direction. That way the Guardian protects the sentry gun from behind. The trophy system guards the sentry gun from the front. And then it allows the sentry gun to just take full advantage of the open pathway in between the enemy spawn point and B. Um, I only was able to get 6 kills because we ended up flipping the enemy spawn. But uh, hopefully this helps you out. Uh, thank you so much for stopping by. And leave in the description if you'd like to know um, some more great placements for toys.